If you're in a big city, uh, you're probably going to want to ride the subway or the metro quite a bit because it's a really convenient way to get around. This is what one of the entrances looks like uh, going down, uh, down underground. There'll be a security check um, when you come into the station and they'll want to scan your bags and make sure you don't have anything dangerous in there. You figure out where you want to go using a subway map which will look something like this and it actually has the names both in Chinese and in English. It's handy to have a, a uh, paper copy uh, to carry around with you as well and maybe use a street map to figure out exactly where you want to go uh, and where the nearest stop is that you want to get off at. Actually, even on your ticket, it, um, it shows all of the main lines and where the transfer stations are, so that can help you to uh, know what you need to do if you're transferring as well. You can buy your tickets from these cool machines, and there's even a little button that you push, and it's going to translate it all into English, and then you put your money in and you get your ticket. If the machines aren't working, you can just buy your tickets from the little ticket counter and it costs 2 yuan to get pretty much anywhere, so you don't have to say where you want to go, you just give them 2 yuan and they'll give you a ticket and you're good to go. You then just swipe your card and it opens up to let you through. On the subway platform there will be a sign like this, uh, which lets you know which direction train is going in so because there'll be another platform on the other side and so you don't want to go the wrong direction but it's pretty easy to figure out uh, uh, which side you want to go on to head to the stop you want to get to. Inside the train above the doors um, they have this display with flashing lights sometimes they look a little bit different but basically this lets you know which stop you're at which stops coming up and uh, so it's really easy to keep track of where you are and where you need to get off the train. They also make an announcement before you reach the stop and they do it both in Chinese and in English. The trains get pretty full, this actually isn't too bad, um, we're fairly early in the morning but it can be jam packed. There can be a bit of a crush uh, getting on and off, people trying to get off, other people trying to get on at the same time, but it all seems to work out okay.